Change 160 years of history of petitions being circulated through the unincorporated town of Menasha supporting making part of the town a village to protect its borders from more encroachment from adjacent villages and cities. Tonight, Fox 11's Alex Ronaldo has multiple views. With more than 18,000 residents, the town of Menasha is larger than some cities and villages, including the adjacent city of Menasha. We're the second largest town in the uh, state of Wisconsin, next to Grand Chute. Residents Arden Tews and Dick Jones say until the town becomes a village, its borders are insecure. Cities nearby can take over a town's land. Cities and villages can annex. Towns cannot. We are a town. And so we're a land bank for our neighbors. You know, when they want to expand their t tax base, they come to the towns. So for a year, a committee headed by Jones has worked to incorporate. The town has tried in the past, but was denied by the State Department of Administration. The reason? The department said the east side of town was too broken up. So this time, the request just includes the more populous west side, and petitioners hope to eventually add the east side if the town becomes a village. They suggested to us that we incorporate the west side first and then annex or attach the east side. Jones and other volunteers are circulating a petition. They need 50 signatures to request incorporation, which would first need to be verified by a Winnebago County judge. And already, they have 200 signatures. My 47 signatures, I asked 47 people, 100%. If the petition is verified, the judge would order a referendum. But before any of that could happen, the Department of Administration would need to approve the request. The town board is supportive of the move. We as a board, in budgeting, step, you know, put the money out there to proceed with the incorporation. The board set aside $85,000 for the change, but there is one concern from board members. The people have not been given all the information. So town leaders plan to circulate letters to all residents explaining the plan. And then there's the name Jones chose for the new village, Fox Crossing. It's not very popular. No, I'm not too big of a fan of that. It sounds like a nursing home. But Jones says they will allow residents to vote on a final name. I talked to the town attorney and he said it's not difficult to change the name. Those who support the plan say they want it to create a stronger community. Hope and pray that it does. I really do. In the town of Menasha, Alex Ranallo, Fox 11 News. The town board is expected to vote within the next month on whether to move forward with the incorporation. Petitioners are hoping a referendum could be on the ballot by the middle of the year.